check on an individual that's been shot with a fucking rubber bullet for standing there. Yeah. As soon as we start giving a raid, they fucking shoot me. They hit us with fucking gas. How is this? How is this fucking legal? That is what they hit you with. Does that look like fucking non-violence? You know what's gonna happen when you fucking do this? That's why people loot, and that's why people fuck shit up. Because you treat everybody like this. You can't fucking blame them. It was fucking peaceful. You know when it got ugly? After four fucking hours of people standing there peacefully protesting, they got gassed, they got flashbanged, they got shot with rubber bullets. What kind of fucking reaction do you think you're gonna get? A fucking handshake? The people are fucking tired. And you come out here and you continue to fucking do it? and act like you're fucking trying to better the relations, fuck out of here. Wake up, stay in numbers, everybody needs to fucking unite. It's bullshit, dude. This is fucking all illegal protesting. That is fucking illegal. But you're going Let's do it. Let's do it. Said too. We're here to help you guys. We need to come together as one. Let's do it. Too long they've tried to race bait us to hate each other. Fucking right. And that's bullshit. Let's do it. We need to come together as one. I Let's do it. Iraq, speak all shit. people. I, I served in Iraq with people all colors. Green. No mention of the other groups. And by the way, no mention that he has no authority nor any legal process to name a U.S. group or organization a terror organization. We don't even have a domestic terrorism law in the United States yet, yet let alone a process to designate a group. And I'll go a step further. Antifa is not a recognized group or organization in the sense of a centralized headquarters, leadership. They are a diverse network. They're not about centralization. And what I fear, Brian, tonight is that this takes us one step closer to a president who simply wants to allow feds to investigate his political opponents. Where is it? He was the hat and green shirt. Quick your hands up. 